Hello, hello, howdy. Welcome to Ghost of Tomorrow. Now, it is a game, which we've established is a game. It's the day of August 23rd, 2019, and you wake up in your apartment alone. How sad. I'm depressed already, and I haven't even clicked start game yet. Suddenly, strange events that possess a paranormal nature begin to occur. These paranormal events seem to transcend the boundaries of both space and time. And these events may give you a glimpse of what is yet to happen in the future. Experience is paranormal in Velen... Fleck, fleck. Let me try that again in English. Experience these paranormal events and see what tomorrow holds. Start game. I am N. Wasad to me. Jesus Christ! I wasn't aware of a current date, August 23rd, 2009. Ha! I already knew that, because I already fucking made it! You what? Is that my phone? That looks like a phone. I'll get to you in a second once I've realized why the fuck you had some sort of weird insidious noise there. Okay! <clears throat> Alice. I've been calling and texting you for two days, and you haven't answered. I haven't heard anything of you for days. Where are you? Are you okay? Please, the call me. My mom, your mom, somebody's mom. So I am Alice. I am the girl. I have a nice bedroom. I have a big fucking TV. What? Why am I carrying a flashlight in my own home for? It does not matter. Oof. I have a black eye now because I hit myself in the face with a goddamn door. I'm not going in there. Oh. Devil. Whoa. Oh my god. Shut up. The only ghost thing here is my door. Door? No door. Oh no. Shh. Door? No door. Hold door. Hold door? Hold door. Oh, look at that. It's disappearing in the reflection in the window as well. Ha ha ha. Paranormal. Hello? Do it. There we go. Uh -huh. Okay. I'm not really best pleased about the choice of colours. Piss yellow was never my forte of co colours to choose. It is currently five past eight. I believe in the evening. Actually, this is very nice. I like it. It's roomy. And a knife. Can I have a look at... What is that? Is that the paranormal? Let me communicate using... Sign language. It didn't work. Ah... <sighs> Okay. That is a horrible looking vase. Oh. Click. Oh, it does work! This is a horrible hallway. These are... weird pictures. This is a weird house. Or apartment. Can I get in here? Oh no. I'm locked out of my own place. Are you something out the window? Let me just rub my ass. Oh. Welcome on the inside. That makes no sense. This should be on the outside of the door. Am I getting in here? You... Shut your face, wherever chair moved. Oh, oh, paranormal. It's beginning. <clears throat> okay, let me compose myself. Missing person, Alice Garayam. Last seen outside Wyman University on August 23rd, wearing a white tank top and jean shorts. Brown eyes, dark hair, 5'7", 130 pounds, age 24, pin number this, fucking hell. 
Please con- Why did you say that name? Martha. Oh. Oh, well, fuck. That was easier to read if I just picked it up. Hoo-hoo! Hoo-hoo! I, too, know the sound of an owl. I am no longer the five foot seven. I am now the seven foot eight monster known as the Alice. Grrr. Okay. Ah, my ankle. My glorious ankle. Are you still communicating? Are you in my toilet? Or are you in my bedroom? You fucking what? What did that? What? Ow. Huh? I'm trying to establish what that noise is. Are you in here? Are you a dead bird? Oh. Wait a minute, let's... Oh! It might be the door! It could be a door. I was just doing that turn over here. I know you're having a bit of trouble, but have you tried filling it all the way? You know, grab the handle, turn, and pull. You might get somewhere. Oh no no, don't stop on my account. I'm not getting in either. Apparently I can't operate doors either. I feel pretty. Can I get out here? No. Oh well, you're fucked. Where am I going now? Oh. Ask and you shall receive. I would like a million dollars. Oh, well, fuck you then. Let me go into my... Let me go into my bathroom. Oh, there's a paper. Okay, here we go. I get it! I get it! <clears throat> Missing student found brutally murdered by roommate. Nice. Roommate confesses murder. Alice Graham, a 24-year-old master's degree student who was missing since August 23rd, was found brutally stabbed and killed. Alice Graham's roommate, 25-year-old Gail Rogers, was arrested yesterday as he confessed to committing the murder. Alice was majoring in film. Well, blah, blah, bloody, blah, blah, blah. Neato. The body of Alice Graham was found in a crawl, ooh, a crawl space. Behind a false wall in the closet of Mr. Rogers' room. Nice. I'm not reading all of this, I just want the juicy bits, like the corpse of chunks of skin sliced off with the knife. A police officer said, This was a very disturbing crime. <laughs> Alice's unnamed friend informed- Unnamed friend? Oh, that poor person. I can't believe her parents hated it so much it didn't even give it a name. Alice always told me about Gail's anger issue. He had a temperament, but Alice would almost calm him down. Alice Graham's friend, <laughs> Alice Graham's friend, unnamed, of course, also informed Alice and Rogers were really good friends. They were the buddies of the sex. They were constantly talking about films and movies. I think Alice was Gail's only friend. Martha, the mum, informed the press. I always knew there was something weird about Gail. Something told me he was involved with a disappearance. Now my baby's gone. I should have called Major Tom to avoid this. Mr. Rudd's family members did not provide information of him because they didn't know him existed. Rogers was currently working at a computer repair shop. His co-workers described him as a really smart person, but was also adding he was a bizarre to He was bizarre too. Not much of a talker. Please find no previous blah blah. Oh no! Oh. I didn't get much of a look. 
You know what? I think the real horror here is that fucking rug. Look at it! How horrible is this? Giant room- oh. The door's shut. Am I in the bathtub? Am I getting out? Hello there. You know what? I got two choices. I can either ignore you or I'm coming to fucking get you. Wait a minute. I thought I was Alice. Let's say round and down to Major Tom. Oh. Oh. Come back. Oh! Whee! Take me! Into the crawl space where I belong, because I've been a naughty girl. Oh! Okay. I think it died. I think. I'm not entirely too sure, but thank you for playing Ghost of Tomorrow. Oh yeah, that's right. It was a demo. I forgot about that. I guess I'm dead. Thank you. I'm going to be stabbed, brutally murdered, and shoved into a crawl space. You know what? I could have spent a worse way to do it on a Friday. So, yes. Tally-ho. Thank you for watching. I'm leaving. <laughs> I quit. Okay. It's all gone dark now. Bye.